Hello, YouTube. I said I was going to do a uh, what was a Q and A on the. Uh, I took questions that were asked to me. What the heck is that? <laughs> the dog. Oh, that were asked to me on the uh, snap, the chat app that I have. People ask me questions. Or, or I said, give me a question you want to ask me on the Q&A for YouTube. And, well, this is the questions I was given. Guess how many questions I was given? Mm, Forty. Fourteen. I'd gum, Jake. <laughs> Fourteen questions. But wiggle it around. You're going to make me sick. <laughs> uh, so the first question that we're going to answer is the first question I wrote down. What is the most superior chicken breed and why? I'm going to give you two, three. No, I'm going to give you two. Two. <laughs> Ready? White leghorn. If you're wanting good eggs, there'll be white eggs. That's what you want. The white leghorn. Best egg production chicken. You can cross that sucker into anything and they'll lay eggs like mad. Uh, now, if you're talking about dual purpose for meat and eggs, the most superior breed, I'd give it a white rock or a Rhode Island red would be one of the top ones I can think of off the top of my head. They're great egg layers. Well, Rhode Island Reds are better egg layers than White Rock, most likely. But they're both good for meat. The White Rock will dress out better. The, the carcass will look better when you dress it because of the white feathers. And you won't have to worry about the red feather uh, quills. In. Okay, number two is what is your Favorite preacher? Oh my gosh, why did you have to ask? I got several here in mind. I'll give you three, I guess. We'll say Adrian Rogers, Tom Gilligan, Gilliam, 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 Billy Graham, Charles Stanley, number five. If I had to give you five, I'm just going to give you four. I can't think of any more. Okay, that's my favorites. If you don't like it, that's too bad there's other ones. I ain't listening to that Joel Osteen or that Kenneth Copeland. I ain't doing that crap. <laughs> fake, fake, fake. Okay, number three. You ready for question three? My dog's barking. How can or how can not communism work? What? What? Whoa, 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 whoa. This is an interesting question, Jake. Well, I'm going to tell you, I'll tell you how it works for people. If you're already poor, it'll work good for you. You ain't going to know you any, you ain't going to know any, any different once it starts. Because it's going to make you even poorer, but you really ain't going to know if you're already dirt poor. You ain't going to, you ain't going to know, it just ain't going to work. Communism, you worship nothing but the government, and the government controls your every action. You can't, I couldn't make a video like this on YouTube. You know why? They'd come after me and kill me. That's because communism does not work. You cannot have freedom of speeches, freedom of religions, freedoms of anything. Communism does not work unless you're already poor and have nowhere else to go to. Remember that. Number four. Is the question called my what is my which my favorite chicken? They want to know which one's my favorite chicken. Oh my gosh! Oh, I don't like picking favorites. You know, that's like picking your favorite kid or something, or favorite grandkid or something. People don't don't do that. You know. But what the heck was that? <laughs> Anyway, I uh, my favorite chicken. 
I really like Thanksgiving. He's my big white chicken. You know, he's wonderful rooster. He's five years old now. He uh, he's been a real good rooster. I'm thinking about crossing him into some chickens right now, so I can get them bigger and see what they look like. I mean, what do I ain't gonna be in it? I can sell them to somebody. I mean, they don't look good. Somebody will like it if I like. Then my other favorite one right now is tater salad. Tater salad is the most, is a beautiful, I have never seen, he's colored like a bangled tiger. You know what a bangled tiger is? You know them orange, black and white tigers, them bangled tigers? Oh, you mean ligers? No, no, that's a lion and a tiger cross. I'm talking about a, ti a, a bangled tiger is what they're called. They live in them them jang jungles, jangles over there in Indiana, or, or India, not Indiana. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, they live over there. They, 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 the orange, they black, and they white. They, they, I, he's colored like that. He's beautiful. He's got three different shades of orange in him. He, he's black and white. I mean, he is just a beautiful rooster. And he's a little bunny. Think about that. Yeah, y'all. Not tall. But yeah. Okay, number question five. How are you preparing for the purge? <laughs> what the heck is that? That ain't funny, Jake. Isn't that that movie you watched? That they come in there and they, they uh, tore apart everything, and stole everything, killed everybody, didn't care about nobody. Nothing. No, the purge, that means there's no laws. That's what I'm saying. Want. It sounds pretty lawless to me. <laughs> what do you mean? The purge's already happened and you see all them riots that happened? How am I preparing? <laughs> I'm not going to tell you that. I can't say that on camera, can I, Jake? <laughs> I don't know what, you, what how you're preparing. What's in that cabinet? Up there? <laughs> I'm not going to tell you. Well, I'm not going to answer that. I'm just going to tell you. I'm I'm pretty well pre prepared. Uh, I'm not going to tell you that. Uh, my biggest role model... And why number six? Oh my gosh. Oh, I have several. Don't you dare do that. Get out of here, you boy. Oh, yeah. That dead good brother. <laughs> Your brother. Go play Fortnite. Go, go drink some toilet water or something. <laughs> Biggest role model. Oh my god. You only need one of that. Probably can't say their names, can I? I'm not legal. Anyway. You can. No, I can't, because they now don't have permission. I'll get in trouble. Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. Biggest role model, I would say. Oh, he taught school 50-some years. Poured his heart and soul in that. Anything he did. Sunday school teacher. Best wonderful guy, farmer, everything. That's who he is. Okay. Number seven. You ready for this one, Jake? No. <laughs> I can't say this on camera. <laughs> oh, well. You can't say anything on camera. What was the nastiest toilet you have ever seen? <laughs> is that thing zoomed in on me? In on okay. I'll tell you what the nastiest toilet was I ever seen. That toilet had enough hair on it you could have made a wig. Nasty, nasty thing. Oh gracious, take it out of there. Don't zoom in on it. Okay. I think it was in Missouri. Yeah, it was in Missouri. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> okay, number eight. Is your dog deaf or blind? Because most white dogs are. Is the dog on the porch? Yeah, he's sleeping. Go ahead and show the dog on his mattress. That's his mattress. Normally we don't have the mattress on the back porch, but you've got a new mattress. We haven't taken it off to burn it yet, and the dog's kind of taking it off. Okay, okay, come back here and put it on me. I'm the real star. <laughs> I'm serious. 
Um, no. I had no. I, I've never heard that about white dogs being deaf and blind, or blind and deaf, or either one or the or the other. He's not either one. He can see good, and he can hear me too. Let me tell you. <laughs> I holler and he'll come over there too. I don't think he's deaf or blind. He's neither one. Okay. Here's number nine. Ready for this? How did the big white chicken get his name? That was Thanksgiving. He's 10 pound white English orpheton. 10 pounds? He looks like 30. Well, he's 10 pounds. I don't know. Well, your skills did. He, uh, he's a, how did he get his name? My friend said he looked like a turkey. She asked me what's his name. I can't say her name because I don't have her message. And she said, she said, that thing needs a name. I said, yeah, probably. So she named him Thanksgiving after a big old dig of, you know, turkey, you eat turkey on Thanksgiving. That's how he got his name at the Wayne County Fair. Number 10. Here's number 10. You ready for number 10? That's all the fingers I got. Yeah, that's all the fingers I got. Are you becoming the new paltry superintendent for the 4-H? Where's the paper at? I'll sign it right now is what I got to say. Yeah, I'm going to do that. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to. As soon as I graduate out this year, of it, I'll, be, I'll, sign, I'll sign my name on the dotted line. I'll be, I'm ready. I'll do it. Yeah. Number 11. Oh, my gosh. Come here and read this. Come here and read this. Come here and read this. You don't believe what this one says. I can't answer. You got to shut your mouth when I answer this question. Because <laughs> you know, you know, read that. Don't yeah. gun down the camera. Why is your weight going better than work? Shut up. Don't you even say nothing. <laughs> I don't even know what you said. Did you not read it? <laughs> no, I can't read your writing. Well, that's good. It's a one-way, like a one-way window. Okay, you won't read it. <laughs> Why is your white dog, Hoss, who's sleeping out there on that mattress, which we, I don't really know why that mattress is there, but it is, uh, better than your other dog, Angel? <laughs> He don't kill chickens. That's why he's better. I don't have dogs that kill chickens. I'll give them somebody else that wants them. Ain't that right, Jake? <laughs> yep. That's what I thought. <laughs> what's your favorite food? Number 12. What's your favorite food? You want me to answer that one? <laughs> sure. Answer it. Fried chicken. Oh, I love fried chicken, but that ain't it. <laughs> I love crab rangoon. Oh my gosh. Slap the socks off of you. Oh. Woo. I love it. I'll eat it all day, Dad. Gum long. I'm telling you. I love it. Crab rangoon. The best one's up there at that Salem, Illinois, Chinese restaurant. Got that best crab rangoon that you ever eat. But, uh, I like I like any Oriental Chinese foods, whatever they call them. I love that stuff. Oh, okay. Question thirteen. Am I zoomed in? Still, don't zoom in on me if I am. You're not zoomed in. Okay. Sometimes you do stuff on there. I don't know how you do it. I, all I know is how to get on Facebook mm -hmm. and watch YouTube on it. <coughs> what do you miss most? About high school? Question mark. Oh, that's because it is a question. Ah, I probably miss the most would be FFA trips and FFA in general. I miss that the most. I love that, and you know, the 
that door's closed and you move on to the next one, but I really enjoyed that. I really do miss that the most. Did you make up any questions to ask me? Nope. Well, okay, question 14. We've got to make it 20 questions, right? So you got to come up with six questions. Your crazy middle school moment. Crazy middle school moment. I don't even remember what ha I ate for supper last night, let alone what happened eight years ago, round about eight years ago. My gosh. Oh, my gosh. I don't even... <laughs> going to have to really clear the dust out up here to get it to make it there. Oh my gosh, dead gum, I don't remember. We went to the St. Louis Zoo once. And I didn't know if we were going to make it or not. It wasn't really crazy or nothing. I don't remember much from middle school other than my, my teachers. No, oh, one time these kids got in a fight on the playground. I thought they was going to kill each other, but they didn't. I thought I just kind of enjoyed watching it, like watching WWDE, but you ain't got, you know, is that the right, is that how you say it? WWE? No, WWE. Yeah, WWD. No, WWE. WD40. Yeah, WD40. <laughs> but I don't really remember anything crazy yeah, about middle school. Of course, I don't remember much about middle school. I got, I, got, I got my first attention in middle school one time. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, uh, you got any questions, Jay? Come up with a daggum question. <laughs> Landon. Get Landon to come in here and ask me a question. Landon! Why'd you have to? I could have done that. <laughs> you said you told me. Well, I'm out of questions. I guess. Well, I hope you enjoy this uh, A and Q. Is that what they're called? A and Q, Q and A. Q and A. I'm like A and W, isn't that root beer? I, I like root beer. I actually, I really don't like root beer. <laughs> At all. One time I drank 12 glasses. <laughs> and I didn't like it any better before I drank them. So, anyways, that's about all I got for the A and Q. Y'all have a good one.